Well, hello and welcome to Max's Kitchen Sink, the best kitchen sink that's kind of filling up with dishes. Anyway, today we're going to be talking about divisions three, two, and one of the Sunshine Coast District Cricket Association. What are we at? Round three for divisions two and three, and round 10 for division one, because do you guys pay more or something? I don't know. Anyway, let's start with Division 3. Kuroi Yumundi, uh, 4 for 153, was defeated by USC. Uh, 3 for 155. Looks like they chased that down, or maybe they just kept Kuroi Yumundi that little bit short. Anyway, for Kuroi Yumundi, uh, G Cunningham got 58 with the bat, and M Young, 33. Nice work there. For USC, M Farah, 59, and H Van Eden, 53 not out. Bowling for Karoya Mundi, M A Carmen, 2 for 41. Maruchidor Red played against Mullaney, defeating Mullaney. Lots of runs going around there. Mullaney scored 9 for 222, and then Maruchidor Red, 5 for 227. Lots of runs going on, but. Maruchidor, you don't have your scores in. I thought with all the things that you have master classes on, scoring might be one of them. Anyway, bowling for Mullaney, IP McConnell, two for 62. And batting for Mullaney, Jay Corkin, 100. Nice. And P Hogan, 32, also adding to the score. Moving on now, Burpengary, all out for 138. Either that or just retired. No one got out, but... There's a number of batsmen there. So, Burpengary, 138. L. Wilmot, 36. B. Armstrong, bowling for Maruchidor Blue, 3 for 20. Looks like there was some wickets there. Must have gotten all out. T.J. Waterhouse, 3 for 45. And R. Jobson, that's right, not J. Robson, but R. Jobson, 2 for 34. So, Burpengary, defeated by Maruchidor Blue. Batsman for Burpengary, uh, DP Syed, or yep, that's what we're going to go with. 59, TJ Waterhouse, 36. And of course, those batters for Marucci Dor. Um, we're also the bowlers, R. Jobson, not going to say the same things again. 35, SR Lucky, 29. Bowling for Burpengary, MC Halliwell, sounds spicy. 3 for 37, T Bailey, 2 for 53. Nice work. Final match for Division 3. Palmwoods, 7 for 147. Defeated Nambour, 8 for 143. Sounds like that could have been a close one. P. Gundry for Palmwoods, 35, as well as C. Cuxon, 33. And bowling for Nambour, Ollie Pitcher, 2 for 7. Uh, JJ Singh, 2 for 26. And B. Perrin, 2 for 34, sharing the wickets around. And also, for Nambour, our bowlers aren't our batsmen. So, batsman for Nambour, J.T. Wine? Win? Oh, that's too many letters. 71. Uh, D. Cowie, 34. Bowlers for Palmwoods. Garabedian, 3 for 38, and N Morse, 2 for 23. So close to a Richie there, Nick. Unlucky. Anyway, let's move on to division number two. That wasn't creepy, was it? Might have been a bit creepy. So, starting that one again. This is take one, I promise. Uh, division number two. Okay, let's get right to it. So, Coolum was defeated by Tawantan Noosa. If you want to know what happened, so do I. That's about as much information as I've got on that one. So, call them. Don't know what happened. I'm going to assume you were defeated by Tawantan Noosa. I feel like I'm repeating myself. Let's move on. Maruchidor. Still feel like I'm re repeating myself. <sighs> Eight for 900. No. <laughs> Eight for 194. That sounds more like a cricket match. Uh, so... Defeated by Yandina. Five for 202. Didn't have a good weekend, did you, Maruchidor? Anyway, uh, Zaren Smith, 69, not uh, out. It wasn't, it was a not, not out. Uh, Nathan Grazier, beefy, 48, so close. 
Bowling for Yandina, MJ Bruton, 2 for 13. Batting for Yandina, M Trace, 58. And MJ Bruton, 48 not out. Bowling and batting. I think someone might try and poach you. Um, T. Luiki, also 31. And bowling for Maruchidor, someone who wasn't a batter. Someone's going to have some words. L. Smith, 2 for 33. Good cricket all round there. Moving on, Glasshouse, 9 for 143. Defeated Caloundra, 9 for 108. Uh, with uh, batting for Glasshouse, B. Molini, 61. A. Crawford, bowling for Caloundra, 2 for 15. J. Crawford, 2 for 18. And A. Dreghorn, 2 for 28. Batting for Caloundra, A. Crawford, B. Stoke. You know, A. Crawford, 28. B. Stokes is not uh, a score that you can get with a bat. Uh, but bowling for Glasshouse, B. Stokes. It's almost like I've said that name. 3 for 30 and M. Diggles, 2 for 16. Hey, over here, just quickly. I need you to go to my video and uh, give it a like and maybe make a comment because uh, everyone knows I'm the OG. Mano's kitchen sink, not Max's kitchen sink. Uh, so give me a like, because you know my videos are better. And, um, oh, 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 I gotta go, give me a like. Give me, give me, give me. Caboolture 103 was defeated by Palmwoods, eight for 205. It's like you did twice as much as you need to there, Palmwoods. Anyway, Caboolture batsman, D. Worrell, 27. Just scraped into the uh, to the mentions there. Nice work. And bowling for Palmwoods, L. Pringle, 4 for 24. M. Peruzic, 3 for 14. And Hayden Guest, 2 for 18. Nice work, Hayden. And speaking of Maruchador, batting for Palmwoods, Hayden Guest, 65 not out. Do it all. L. Pringle as well, 34 with the bat. And uh, C. Taylor, probably not going get, to get poached, only being in the one column there. For Caboolture... No. C. Taylor's with Palmwoods, 25. For Caboolture, J. McManus, 3 for 13. Z. Clark, 3 for 72. Lots of runs there. Um, that's almost the whole of Caboolture's score. That's kind of crazy. Bit unlucky. They must have gone to town on you. But you did get three wickets, so you went to town on them as well. Anyway, let's move on to a different division and a different round just to mess things up. Division 1, round 10. If you're struggling to follow along, you can feel how it's like to be in my brain where there's too many tabs open. We're talking about Division 1, round 10. That's just, it's round 3. It's round 3 of the actual competition. Anyway, uh, well, we had to start there. Well, uh, Nambour, 119 all out, was defeated by Maruchidor, 8 for 239. They could have saved some runs for some other games. They might have gone... Let's just uh, end that one there. Batting for Nambour, Steve Ledger, 70. And bowling for Maruchidor, L McInnes, 3 for 6. B Slosh, as Jack uh, Bambling would say, 3 for 19. And M Armstrong, 2 for 8. Maruchidor with the bat, M Watson, 91. Yeah, someone's going to leave a like for that. Uh, D. Stewart, 38. S. M. Jones, 36. Bowlers for Nambour. Drew Pitcher took away 4 for 41. Liam Baker, 2 for 30. And S. O. I. B. The Binchuk, 2 for 34. Nice work. Moving on, Gimpy, 96. It was defeated by Kabulcha, 6 for 203. If only they uh, had to save some runs for the next day, next day then maybe... I feel like I'm repeating myself. Um, batting for Gimpy, JD Brady, 48 not out. PJ White, oh Brady, sorry, someone. It should have just been a bunch of people to stay in with you a bit more and you would have got that at 50. Anyway, PJ White for Caboolture Bowling, four for 16. C Cor Corlett, there's no second C in there. C Corlett, two for nine, two for 29. Tabs, too many open. And Jay Flew, thanks for joining the commentary in uh, the uh, final. Go check that out. There'll be a link somewhere. We'll look at that. Uh, Jay Flew, two for 34. Batting for Caboolture, Glenn Batachotto, 76. 
P. White, 54, and bowling for Gimpy, uh, BP Mitchell, uh, two for 28, fueling most of the innings there. Moving on to what Noosa, <laughs> I thought I was going to get away with that. Tawantan Noosa, 5 for 103, defeated Coulomb for 102. See, they saved up their runs for the next day, and it seemed to help them out. Uh, Tawantan Noosa batting, L. War, 25, and bowling for Coulomb, R.J. Briggs, 3 for 26, opening his account there with the ball. Coulomb with 102, S. Sheepers, 29, and C. Perrin, nice work, Corey, 26. Just scraping into the mentions. Bowling for Tawantan Noosa. T. Stewart, 5 for 19. Five for. Don't know if you took more wickets tomorrow, but you definitely weren't trying to save them up. Final match. Caloundra, all out for 139 with D. Cross, 32. SP Underhill, 29. And Glasshouse, five, oh, 9 for 157. With bowlers for them, H. Fisher, 4 for 33, L. Manuel, 2 for 42. Batting for Glasshouse, J. W. Owen with 42. The big man, Moff, 37. And bowling for Caloundra, S. P. Underhill, 5 for 18. Well, good cricket all round. Sorry for my brain momenting thing, talking, ordering. Um, yeah, remember to check out the other Kitchen Sink videos. You don't need to like any of them unless they are hosted by the awesome Jackie Sparkles. We'll see you next week. Hopefully, my functioning brain will be, as Yoda say he would. Speaking of braining order in, um, if you think that better job could you do, don't. Email uh, Max at T Max will no. Speaking of <laughs> speaking of braining, um, just remembered something. If you think that you could do a better job than this, and let's face it, you can't. So don't bother sending an email to Max at Telestream.tv saying that you could host this better than me if you're available on a Monday night to come in and talk for. Is it Tuesday morning yet? Who are you, Dr. Dirty Dan?